Hey guys, got a little project here today. We're going to install the antenna, TV antenna, and we're going to uh, install a TV and find a home for it while we're traveling. So let's uh, let's see what we have. All right. These just came yesterday from uh, my favorite supplier, Amazon Prime. <laughs> uh, we're going to try one of these omni directional long range antennas here. Um, this had pretty good reviews. I've never used one like this, I've had the crank up type. But uh, I didn't want to get involved in that, so um, I figure we go to a stationary one that will, um, again, pick up 360 degrees. And then I ended up going with a 27-inch, 28-inch uh, Smart TV 12-volt, uh, again, Amazon. Uh, it's preloaded with YouTube, Netflix, and uh, Amazon Prime, which I'm a member of. So we'll get all our movies through there. I'm not going to subscribe to Netflix. Um, hopefully, I'm not going to be in the van watching too much TV. But on in the evening and, you know, a shitty afternoon, uh, it'll be something to occupy uh, some time on the inside. So let's, uh, let's first of all, let's, let me show you how I installed the um, antenna, okay? Let's go up here on the roof. Uh, the best place to put it, I thought, would be forward. You don't want it too far to the, uh, to the AC on it. Uh, it needs, needs to have a pretty good clearance around it. Uh, so when, when I get up there on the roof, I'll show you. There's a there's a two foot by two foot area uh, that that is not covered with solar, and I figured that would be the best place to put it. So let's head on up. Now on this particular van, we have we have our vent for the, our plumbing. This is a vent for the shower area. And then this little box right here is an accessory cable uh, box. And inside the cabinet, um, you have a little access hole where any wires going in here can come right down into your electrical uh, cabinet. So, I, I, I didn't want to mount this down here because then this here antenna would be flush with the solar panels and I figured I'd have interference. So uh, I wanted to keep this up a little bit. So I mounted it right on this here heavy gauged uh, whatever this rotor molded plastic. And um, I drilled the hole in the center because the cable from the antenna goes right down through the shaft here and uh, it goes right down the center of this here tube square tube into the cabinet uh, I just basically screwed this flange onto the top of here I used Gorilla adhesive sealant real strong strong stuff I put a bead on the underside of this here base and then I, there's six screws, I screwed it in, and then I just put a dab on top of each screw. So this thing, this is, this is, this is on there solid. This is not, and I just did this like three hours ago. It's is on there really good. So that was, that was pretty easy. That was an easy installation as far as this hair goes. So now the wire is right down into the cabinet. So let's go inside and see what we have going on there. All right, now we're inside. This is the cabinet that is right behind the uh, 
driver's side here. So is this upper cabinet? There's your shower right there. Oh, I just added a mirror. My mirror finally came in. Put that up. Uh, so this is like I said the other day. This is my uh, electrical cabinet, where everything that has to do with electrical uh, will be up in here. Um, but up here is a little hole. Actually, there's a plate. There's a plate right here, and that plate is right up on the ceiling. I have to drill a hole through here, and then this cable will, will, will come right through. I'll put that plate. I'll put that that plate right back up there. But for now, we'll just leave that off. So this is the antenna. Came right down, and uh, I have all my power. I have power outlets here, and then we also have outlets up in here and with this here table I, uh, I might be able to turn this this way put the TV here and I'll just reverse this chair around so I can watch it I, this will be like a, a, a little TV area here I have this here cushion as a, uh, a, a stool footstool uh, to keep my legs elevated um, and then I may run a cable through the ceiling up here and have it come out inside the lounge area up there on the ceiling um, and then I'll be able to put the TV right here when the bed is in when this bed is down in um, bed mode I'll be able to watch TV in bed um, so that's my plan uh, so that that this is was pretty pretty easy probably 20 minutes to do all this uh, um, there was more time just figuring it out how I was going to go about all this so what I did now to store store the uh, TV is I put it with the, this put this storage right underneath right here so here's where I put the TV right down in here um, I have all the cables here that I need, and then we have this cable. I'm getting Dishy, which is a Starlink, so I'm going to have room here to put the Starlink cable and uh, the Starlink itself. I haven't figured out where I'm going to store that. Uh, I'll, find a, I'll find a spot for it somewhere, a little box, maybe just leave it in the back somewhere. Um, but yeah, that's this is where the TV will go right here. And uh, uh, a nice little spot for it. It's protected. And we still have, we still have a cabinet back here. I haven't figured out what to put in there. Maybe I'll put my chemicals and my cleaning stuff in there, or I can put my. Oh no, that you know what that that's going to be my laptop. That's where I'll stick my tablet and laptop in there, and then my drone. My drone might fit right in here. So yeah, this whole area is like the electronics and video area. So that, that will work out. That's where I'm going to put all that stuff. So, um, yeah. Uh, what else did I do today? Oh, a plate came in. Let me show you our plate. There it goes. Yeah, we have our little front plate. Revel Adventures. Hey, right, folks, that's it. That was a little project for today. Uh, we got our TV antenna squared away. I like the screen. I like this how that has a magnetic. You just open that right up, go in. Then when you're done, it just uh, there's, a, there's two magnets right here that close together. Keep the bugs out. Uh, this is this is a great little from Canada. Um, actually, that that came with the van. All all the rebels come with that. Uh, and then we have the same one for back here too. I haven't used it yet, but you unroll that. You have the screen, and then you have the blackout over that also. So, still waiting for my uh, cabinets to come in. Getting ready. I'm leaving in two weeks. Heading uh, heading to Jacksonville. 
Um, then we're going up to New England for a while, so I might get in under the gun and get this thing packed and ready to go. All right, catch you on the next one.